everybody, welcome to PTZ Optics Live. This is the holiday edition. My name's Tess Protesto. And I'm Paul Richards. Today is, like we said, our holiday bazaar here on PTZ Optics. We are doing presents, treats, and we are also inviting you to join us live via Zoom video call. So have your microphones and cameras ready. When we post the link in the chat, you'll be able to hop on and have a live Q&A with us. We're going to hang out. What are we going to do? Everybody, we welcome. To yeah, we know we've got a really cool new agenda for today. Um, we've got some presents that we're going to open. I think you guys are going to really be interested in what are in these boxes. Um, so we're going to open these presents. Before we do, Tess actually is really getting into the holiday spirit, and she wanted to show how to wrap live streaming cameras properly. Hello, and welcome to That's a Wrap with Paul, my elf, and Tess. Today we're going to tell you how to wrap the perfect Christmas present. There's going to be three things that you are going to need. First, wrapping paper. Second, scissors. And third, tape. I forgot one last thing. You can't forget about the perfect gift. For example, a PTZ Optics 20X SDI camera. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, you did so great. I think that you actually deserve this present. Oh, thank you. I'll put it under the Christmas tree. Happy first. holidays from PTZ Optics. Happy holidays. Alrighty, All what did you guys think? That's our little bit that we prepared for you guys. Thankfully, I had my elf Paul helping me along the way, and this is the present. Can it's I open unopened. It now? It has been sitting under our tree, and now it says your name on it. Okay, you well, I got it. something for you, too. Thanks. I think this will be good for your beauty show. Okay. So let's go ahead and open our presents. Ooh, it's a PTZ Optics camera test. I already have, like, so many of these. Why do you need to do Honey, these? that is not just a PTZ Optics camera. Really? That is an NDI upgraded PTZ Optics 12X SDI camera. You updated the firmware for me? Yeah. Uh, I, ha I get by with a little help my from my friends, but uh, I did update so it for you. So this camera has NDI on it? This camera, and Ooh. that's not, this isn't a bit. That camera has NDI on it. We did the upgrade and it's oh ready for you. Oh my gosh. And I got a microphone. Oh, you got the new microphone. It's going to pair perfectly my with my Z cam. I thought that would be perfect for your beauty streaming space. It will. So this NDI camera, all I have to do is plug it into the That's network and we're good to go? That's right, Paul. Plug it in the network. So let's get it into. Let's plug her in and I'll just go ahead and do one cable simplicity is what the deal is here. So boop. All right. It's turning on. It's coming alive. It's alive. <laughs> It's alive! So now that it has been turned on and plugged in, what I'd like to do is two things. One is show you guys just how easy it is to bring it into, I'm thinking, vMix. Here is the big test of all tests. Here we go. The first functional NDI upgraded PTC Optics camera that I've do, played do, around do, with. Do, 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 do. All right, so. One of the things I've noticed is you do need to go ahead, and this is going to be a great little tutorial as well, is that you do need to know the IP address of your camera, and I wanted to show just how easy this is. So if we go to 192.168.1.58 and hit enter, um, I, this is brand new. I just found out about this. If we go to the video tab, there's something called NDI mode. And we all wish this was under our tree. As you can see here under NDI mode, we have the option to do high, medium, or low. Okay. I would say let's go ahead and do high 
There's a new setting that's 720p, 120 frames per second. I'm not honestly even sure what that would be good for you to be used for. You tell me. But what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead, and now that we've set up, I just have to go ahead and hit save on the NDI mode, and I'm going to go ahead and reboot the camera, and this puppy is going to be 100%, uh, let's see where the system, reboot, ready to be pulled directly into any NDI system. So we'll let it reboot. Now that I've selected the NDI settings that I want it to go ahead and exhibit, and we'll be able to pull this directly into Wirecast or VMix or XSplit or OBS. So I wanted to show that off real quick. And then we're going to go into a full Q&A. So Tess, you're going to be sharing the Zoom link for everybody. Okay. Um, where is the Zoom link? Um, it's, in the, it's, in, it's on Google Calendar, and it's also in the um, description of YouTube. All right. Here there she is right there. PTZ Optics Camera. And you can see it says the channel. You can name these, but you can see the channel says 58. Boom shaka. <laughs> and here it is, super low latency. Now, here's the great part about it all, too, is that um, I can still control it over IP. So what I'll do, I'll just set a couple settings here. So what I'm going to do is going to go ahead to PTZ Optics, type in the IP, 192.168.1.58, connect. So I can still control this puppy over the network. Uh, and uh, I can also go ahead and... Um, control it over NDI as well. Something I, we're going to be talking about more in the coming months, but that is the new NDI camera. Just wanted to show it off. Uh, let's have some fun and jump into our next segment, which is... Let's do it to it, Lars. The Q&A, right? Mm -hmm. Were you able to find the Q&A Zoom link? Mm -hmm. It starts with 251? 275. 275, that's right. Yep. All right, guys. Join away. We're going to see you guys in the post show, basically. This is Hopefully, a &A. Uh, you guys want to join in. Was there anything? Did we forget something? Was there something we missed? No. No, that's it. That was it. it. We opened the presents. The NDI care was here. And now we're going to go ahead and jump directly into a Q&A with you guys. We want to talk to you. That's what the holiday is all about. Friends, family, customers, so, everybody. So how are we going to display this? Did you pull in my frame? Um, I have to pull in your frame, set it up. <laughs> so go, get, go ahead and sit in the, the wonderful chairs we have here. Michael and I are going to go ahead and bring in the Zoom callers. All right, I'm going to hang with all you all right. fantastic people over here. Let me plug my headphones in as you log on. And this way, I can hear you. Let me plug my headphones in headphone volume needs to go down. On. Too high for you? It's on. I can hear myself. Oh, okay. You blew right past Tessa's microphone. Let's see it. <laughs> I think that that's null and void at this point. Oh, my jeans are blue. Would you look at that? My jeans are blue, so you can see through them a little bit. Today was a green screen fail. Troy says, where are presents? I could use more coal. I was considering getting Paul coal, but I didn't want to lose my job, so I figured I better get him something good. Looks great. Need one for my church, Lou Dog says. Soon enough. Um, soon enough. We're rolling out 12X SDI. NDI upgrades first, uh, and I believe followed by 20x SDI, but uh, you know, it's going to be a process. Oh, you know what? Who's with us? Someone's yeah. with us. Can you hear them? No, I think that my volume is on somebody's computer. Followed by 20x SDI, but uh, you know, it's going to be a process. Right, tell me something, Tess. Do you hear? Oh, you know what? Someone's with us. Can you hear them? No, I think somebody who. So when you're logging on to chat with us today, a couple things. Make sure you have a webcam and microphone enabled on Zoom. 
Also, make sure your computer volume is turned down. You're using headphones. This way, uh, the audience doesn't hear uh, a, repetition, a repetition, repeated play. New Grace Media, no, I did not get new glasses. Still have the old ones. Okay. This should be good. <laughs> Troy says, nice trout spot. Yeah, this would be a, a good fishing location. All right. Yay, we have friends. What do you think, Tess? Is it working? Can you yep. hear them? Who do I recognize? Chris? I'm here. Yeah, Harold. can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. How's it going? Super. I'm jealous of all your snow. You are? <laughs> uh, well, I'm from Buffalo, and I live in Oregon now. So oh, we don't that's right. A lot of snow. Oh, gosh. Buffalo gets those huge this snow This would drifts. be nothing. Yeah, no well, year I, compared to Buffalo. If anyone anyone watched the NFL last weekend, the Bills during their game got like six inches of snow during the game. Yeah, huh. I, I did. I did. That's catch always a entertaining bit of that. when that happens. Do any mainstreaming Hi. video conferencing platforms support NDI? Yeah, we had eight inches here outside of Atlanta last week this time. What? Wow. Yeah, that was crazy. All my friends in, in Atlanta and in, in Georgia and Texas, they all got snow, and I'm sitting here with nothing. It was sad. Yeah, it was a little surreal. My buddies in Ontario were like, there's no snow on the ground in Ontario, but there's almost a foot of snow on the ground in Atlanta. Jeez. Perfectly normal, I guess. <laughs> so. the, uh, 